Hi, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy. We're going to be reviewing Guardians of the Galaxy today by Stern Pinball on location at Rec Bar in Louisville, Kentucky. Owner's a great guy, beautiful selection here, so check it out when you get the chance. Beyond that, please look for a review underneath the description of our YouTube video. There you'll find our written out metrics of all of our thoughts, likes and dislikes. Uh, beyond that, also subscribe. If you like arcade, if you like pinball, click subscribe now. That is our format. Let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? So first things first, it's Quill's Quest, so we're gonna get an extra ball on this. Playfield is, is actually set up very good. I actually like the flow of Guardians. It is a top 20 game for me due to its shots and the difficulty of it. So this would make for a very good home use only game. The reason I say it's difficult is because of the narrowness of the lanes. Uh, it's also because of the way that it's stacked to the middle back of the table. The play field is open to the front, but then it is stacked with a bunch of peg bumpers and blocks, which cause it to you, for you to constantly play defense on this game. So with that being said, that's pretty much <laughs> the game in a nutshell. It is a, it, it is a good game for coin op because games are short and fast, unless you're really good. I will say I love the depth of the code. There are so many things that you can do on this game. I mean, look at it, you got Nowhere, Escape Con, you got Sibling Robbery, Antiquities, Pod Chase, Sanctuary, Yak Arrow, Quill's Quest. So many things to do. The depth of this game is insane. But it plays like butter. Traditional non-setup, which is flipper gaps, not too bad. Two in-lanes to the left, in-lane to the right, X lanes to the left, right. You got a Yondu shot that goes up with a, a, a target to the back to the left. You have a orbit going around, which is Ronin, all the way around to the back. And if it's too slow, it will drop into your pop bumpers to the middle back. You have rocket, which is a shot there, which will activate rocket. Nebula ramp goes around, have it trails to your left in-lane. You got group to the middle, which is open right now. You have a little path pass group, which will actually go to the pop bumpers. You have a lock, which I just tried to shoot at, which is generally a drop target. And then you get to the shot. And then you have a ramp, which is Gamora, which exits Habit Trail right in lane. And then of course, to the right of that, you have a lane, which is an orbit. And then to the right of that, where it just went, which I just shot again and again, is the scoop. So now we're all lit up red. What I love about Rocket is it just punches that ball right back to your right flipper, so you really gotta be careful about that. So it's just, it's, it's almost like a dead man shot. It'll get you. But anyway, with that said, artwork is there, modes are there, depth is there, gameplay is there, shots are there. One thing I will say is it blocks to the center back, so the shots have to be really tight. That adds to the difficulty. That makes this game a little bit better for home use as well. So beyond being a coin op person, if you're a collector or want a game that's gonna sit in your house for a long period of time where you don't get bored, this is definitely one of those games. Replayability is there on this game. Fun factor is absolutely there. Soundtrack is good. I, I say the LCD art and cinema graphics are good as well. Table mechanics are set up. It has a, a very high table mechanics score. It just has a lot to shoot at. Theme is what you would expect from Guardians of the Galaxy. Our works there. So, I mean, this is a really good game. I will say the sound bites are actually really good too. As the sound bites keep playing, it sounds really good. I mean, they got a lot of the uh, a, a lot a lot of the uh, action scenes, a lot of the sound bites from the characters on this game. So definitely an absolute must play. Guardians of the Galaxy, Stern Pinball. I mean, if you can find this out on location, 
And if you could even buy it for yourself at your home, I don't think you're going to be disappointed by any means. It's absolutely a, a, a good game to play. But anyway, again, please find our metrics underneath the description of our YouTube video. Until next time, this is your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy signing off. Thank you for watching today.